Understood. Hey, girl. New to the fam. Ah, welcome to the family, sis. Been so happy to have you. Thank you for joining the movement. Represents mama. Oh, yes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> hey, Jay. Hey. I said 777. Look at that. 777. 777. Let's get it. Ooh, they intimidated. They intimidated by that 777, okay? That tree of life, that activation, the movement, G3. We got them intimidated, family. Oh, they be, they tried to sacrifice us because they intimidated. But you see, hold on, let me get my, before we tap in, wait, wait. You know what I'm saying? They trying to jump right into it. <laughs> I didn't even see all of this was under here. All I saw, I just shuffled and put them down and saw the 777. So hold on, hold on. <laughs> Let's bring it on back. It's literally my birthday. Happy birthday. Oh, seven, hold on, seven, 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 seven. Or what? Or today's your birthday? Because if today's your birthday, happy birthday. Happy solar return. They not like us at all. Let them speak. <laughs> We are working together. They not just gonna have this full control now. Just wait, cause it's it's, it's a you know I got a structure a certain way. Dang! <laughs> Happy birthday! Oh, oh, seventy-seven. Okay, okay. Ten seven seventy-seven. Gemini gang in the building. Gemini season. When my my birthday is the eleventh. So where my Gemini's at? Shout out to the Geminis. We here. They hate us. We the, we, we the most hated, but we the most loved too. Make it make sense. <laughs> the most hated and the most loved. We real special. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you to everybody who is booking, who is donating, keeping the lights on, keeping your sis going, keeping me flowing. I got some YouTube readings that's uploading. So if you have booked a YouTube reading, you will get your reading by today. I have a few I have to finish tonight, but either way, they are, they are uploading now. Thank you. Thank y'all so much for your love and your support. It truly means a lot. Every time a booking or a donation come through, it truly like... <sighs> brightens up my life <laughs> thank you so so much and um always sending that energy back in return good energy just blessings and love always being returned back to you guys so thank you so much um i have a patreon and you know you can join the subscriptions because every day i come through with the with the guidance keep my my g3 on a a game daily so if you want to tap in with your sis join the g3 join the subscriptions or um Join the Patreon. So anyway, now that that's, you know, okay. Okay, let's go. <laughs> they like, heavy it up. All right, say what you got to say. Let's go. <laughs> anyway, G3, you see the title because we're going to hop right on, to, right on in. You see the title. 
You get the last laugh. You get the last laugh. Sometimes we laugh, sometimes we cry. I, I guess you know now. Babe, yeah. People were laughing, laughing, laughing. Laughing at you. <laughs> laughing at what you were going through. Laughing at your experiences in life. Laughing at your elevation process. They were laughing. They thought it was a joke. They thought that you was a joke now that you are tapping into the energy of the universe. You know what I'm saying? They thought it was a joke now that you're trying to create with the energies of the, of the of, you know, that, that, that the universe is, is releasing off and you're trusting your intuition. They thought you was a, they was laughing at you. You know what I'm saying? Now you, you're getting into nature. You're talking to the animals, the birds and the bees and the trees. They was laughing at you. They was also sending spell work and doing magic too. All because of your growth and elevation and your alignment with self. There's a lot of laughs going on and clearly we see that they were trying to sacrifice the people that intimidated them, which were the ones that were tapping to their true life. Okay, they were trying to sacrifice you G3 here. But Hold on, because I got I got some downloads here. When the hunters become the hunted, there's consequences for, for putting yourself in harm's way. G3, it was a lot of people that put themselves in harm's way hunting you. We are now ex seeing what happens when the hunters become the hunted. We are now seeing what happens when the hunters become the hunted. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the energy has shift, shifted and brought balance. Justice is being served. The energy has shifted. Justice is on the scene and it will be served on a, on a silver platter. On a gold platter. <laughs> they, said, they, they, said, they said justice is being served on a gold platter. Okay. <laughs> These people. They activated all of your ancestors. Coming for you. They activated all of your ancestors coming for you. Hmm. I heard not that one. They should have not played with that one. You are that one. <laughs> you can hunt all you want over there, but leave that one alone. This is what I'm hearing. I don't know what that's about. You can do all you big and bad enough to do over there, but don't touch my anointed and do my prophets no harm. Rules are meant to be broken is what I heard. They set a lot of rules and regulations just so people can break them and they can punish them. <laughs> okay. They put a lot of rules and regulations so people can break them so they can punish them. I don't know. These people like punishment. That's good because now they're being punished. <laughs> the people that like to punish people are now being punished. Look at the energy shift. Hmm. They activated the light and the dark, your light and dark ancestors. All the ancestors ain't light. Let's not act like it. That's why all these people running around here calling themselves dark witches and warlocks and doing all that dark magic and stuff like that. Because all the ancestors ain't light. But they're not supposed to be. It's a balance here. 
the choice here. You should be careful what you choose. <laughs> People hate free will. At one point in the spiritual journey where the spiritual community was big on, there's no free will. There's no free will. And it's like, well, what you want to do? <laughs> what you want to do that you don't want to face the consequences for? Because I feel like those are the only people that scream there's no free will. Get your act right. Because when you when you're moving righteous and you're doing doing the right thing, it's like you can do all you all you big all you want to do. But when you out here acting crazy and something, yeah, there's karma for that. So no, you can't just get away with any old everything. <laughs> there's some things that you want to get you can get away with, and some things that you can't get away with. This just is what it is. So they made laws. They made rules. So they can be broken. But see, laws can't be broken. The universal laws can't be broken here. But the rules could be broken. I don't know where we're going with this, you three, but I'm going. So. The pe these people. Yeah, because I'm talking about don't touch those over there. Don't touch my anointing. You can do what you want to do with those. And, and I don't even feel like it's, you can do whatever you want to do with that over there. I feel like those are the people that's following the rules. And when you follow rules and you break rules, you get punished for these rules. So I can't really do nothing for the punishment of your rules because that's how you got it set up. But these laws right here touch not. My anointed. I don't know how to tell how, to, like I told you, I told you already. I don't know how many times I got to tell you to touch not my anointed. That's not a rule. That's a law. Oh, they, they told you it was only 12 universal laws. Hmm. That's that's because they always forget to count zero. That's what I heard. <laughs> mm. You get the last laugh here, G3. Because they activated all your ancestors. Now that was scary. There's something scary here going on right now. There's something scary going on because these people that are being hunted cannot see their hunters. Mind, my mind. They wear hoods. And they wear, they wear cloaks to mask themselves. The red hoods, the blue hoods. The black hoods, the yellow hoods, a bunch of hoods. <laughs> they wear these color hoods that they want to mask themselves. So, so we can't see who you are, but you're there. But we see that you're there. We just can't see who you are. But we see that you're there, but we can't see who you are. But see, these people are being hunted by people that are, or energy that they know are there, but can't see them. See, it's, it's different. Y'all want to be the hunters so bad, but y'all lack the skills or y'all lack the all it takes to be considered the hunt, hunters. See, like they have earthly hunters, they have spiritual hunters too. And they didn't know that you have hunters in, in your bloodline. You have hunt, hunters. You got those two. Oh my goodness, my family used to love to hunt. I used to want to go with them. Nah, nah, you can't go. I want to go, I want to go, Grandpa. And they come back with the rabbits, the squirrels. They skin them right there. That's real country. Yeah, I come from the country. I come from the south. <laughs> the dirty, dirty. Okay? Dirt roads and outhouses. <laughs> I love it, though. But yeah, they didn't know that you had hunters in your bloodline. Oh, we hunt. We love to hunt. 
You know, before there was phones and before there was internet and before that, we had to just work with what we had. We had to work with nature. <laughs> we had to fish. We had to hunt. That's what that's that was our pastimes. This is this is what your answers are saying. Our, our pastimes were were tapping into the skills of the animals, the real hunters. <laughs> if you want to learn how to hunt, you better watch your animal. <laughs> It's real scary times right now because they don't know what they're looking for. Somebody's being hunted by something. They don't know what it is. They want to know who are your ancestors? Who are your ancestors? As they're in the corner shivering butt naked and sweating. Who are your ancestors? What are their names? <laughs> Somebody is shivering, they're intimidated, they're scared. But why are you trying to sacrifice people anyway? Hmm? This is what be killing me. Why are you trying to do this anyway? <laughs> why, are you... <laughs> why are you trying to sacrifice people anyway? You don't got nothing better to do. I know you got bills to pay. Child support. <laughs> There's things that you got to, to take care of. Um, deportation here. I'm, I'm picking up on different things now. All right? Failing relationships and marriages. These are the people that are trying to sacrifice you. Their relationships, and their, their, their relationships at home are terrible. Their relationships with their children are terrible. Their relationship with, the, with their wife or their wives are terrible. <laughs> they all, this is somebody who drinks. All they do is drink smoke these are the people that's trying to sacrifice you you got other things to worry about you got other things to do and now they're like no okay no i worry about my stuff now okay 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 i'll focus on me now okay okay i i who are her? Who are her ancestors? Who are his ancestors? Okay, I'll focus on me now. I, 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 I'll do what's best for me now. No. No, go run. We like to hunt. <laughs> hey, no, 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 no. We did this. No. Somebody want to come and be like, hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, go run so we can hunt. Okay, we like to hunt. This is a game for us. We like to play. Because that's what y'all like to do. That's what they like to do. They like to have people running while they, while they chasing them down and hunting them. They like to have people worried and scared. They like that's, that's what they like to do. They like to injure people and then get them to run, make them run. And, as, as, and, and, and they chase them down and stuff. This is what they like to do with their hoods on. It's games for these people. not the animals don't they like to chase their food <laughs> they like to chase it down they like to to throw it around wrinkle all up in the air whether you in the fish i mean whether you a fish in the in the in the in the in the in the, in, the, in the open, in, in the water, or burn in the sky, or you on land, every day like their food alive and moving. So stop it. The ancestors are not trying to hear, sorry. We're not trying to hear, sorry, oh, we not. We heard that, okay? God forgave you. You tell, you tell mother and father sorry. You don't tell the ancestors sorry. <laughs> You tell mother and father sorry. And they do the forgetting. You know what I'm saying? The ancestors are like, that ain't, that ain't my job. I ain't got to forget S. <laughs> I'm still mad at what so-and-so did back in so-and-so. And, 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 and that's why I'm not back yet. Because I ain't trying to go through that car. <laughs> 
it's some ancestors that refuse to come back because they're like, no, I know if I come back, I'm going to go through some karma because I'm still holding on to some things. So, so I'd rather just hold on to these things and, and, and take them out on, on y'all. <laughs> to come back and face them. That's what that means to me. <laughs> For real. <laughs> so when I'm like, nah, I'm not coming back. If I come back, I'm going to have to, I'm gonna have to heal. Dang. I mean, Earth is a school, it's a hospital, it's everything. And you got to come back, you got to heal here. It just is what it is. So some of them, <laughs> some of these dark... That's why they, and they remain dark. Oh. So you can either do the work, you can do the work and become a light and become of the light, or you can stay dark and just stay dark. <laughs> That's funny to me. <laughs> so I chose healing. <laughs> She's like, or oh, did y'all make me? Or did y'all force me to choose healing? Because what, what happened? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I did this. <laughs> so I chose, oh, let me go and face my, face my demons. That's what I chose. It's like, I gotta have a talk with you. We're going to have a talk when we get back over there. If, if there is talking. I don't know if, if it's just a stare. I'm going to stare you down. I'll be up there. <laughs> Cursing you out with my eyes. You better never choose that again. No. <laughs> no, no, no. The light is good. It's just, it's just a lot of work. It is. It is. I'm not, why, why front? Why front to act like being of the light is not a lot of work? It is a lot of work. It takes a lot of healing. It takes a lot of balancing out. It takes a lot of accountability. It takes it takes a lot. Okay, it's it's, it's not easy. Okay, so that's why I say that. But I'm I'm grateful I chose the light because at the end of the day, let's do it. You know what I'm saying? Let's heal. I'm here, right? It's, I clearly I clearly thought that this was the best thing. All right. <laughs> All right. I, I don't, I don't know how I feel about it right now. Well, right now I do, but before in the process, it's like, <laughs> but you know, that's why a lot of people, they, a lot of people wake up, like they, 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 they get enlightened and they, they kill themselves. That's the thing. They don't be talking about that, but that's the thing. Because it's like, whoa, because it's not, it's not the, all the information that you, that you're getting. Cause yeah, it's a lot of information. But it's also the healing and the accountability and you looking at yourself and you seeing the monster within and you like, ah, and you're like, oh my God, <laughs> I'm, you take off, you take off all, you know, you've been masking up this monster and you now you got to start taking the, the mask off the monster and it's like, oh, oh. <laughs> now you and this thing is just sitting there looking at each other and it's like, I got to, I got to deal with that. In all of this that's going on in the world at the same time, oh, and they be off themselves because it's a lot. So just give yourself a round of applause to know that you are still here because life is a lot, especially on the path of enlightenment. And be gentle with yourself too because yes, you got to face your demons and yes, it might be ugly, but you and that demon have been rocking this long. So, you know what I'm saying? It's like, y'all kind of have a, a little, y'all have a bond or something going. So, it's not like, like you can talk, you can talk to him. He'll listen to you. Or she'll listen to you. However it goes. <laughs> like, you don't gotta, don't be scared of you. So, be gentle with yourself. Because, yeah. But anyway... So, the Divine Feminine that is with you guys today is Lalita. And this is why I say that you get the last laugh. Because Lalita is about laughing. It's about playful energy. It's about just having a good time. Being in that good energy, in a good space. 
okay i feel like your answer i thought all your ancestors woke up because it was a lot of people in your energy really trying to hunt you down here they were trying to hunt you down and laughing at it too they thought it was a joke They was trying to drive you to suicide. They wanted you to offer yourself. Because they know how the mind is. The mind can be a very fragile. It's very fragile. That's crazy. Before I started working in the hospital, I worked for this place, this um, healthcare place. It was for um, people that had brain injuries. These were regular day people in regular day life. Okay, they just lived their life, went to work, firefighters and just good people that got hit in the head, got into an accident, fell off a ladder. Now they all jacked up, speech all messed up, limbs can't work. The brain is very fragile, but strong at the same time. And somebody was trying to get you to break. This was a psychological attack here. It was like a somebody was trying to mentally break you. Because that's where, that's where your strength is. Your strength lies some in, in, in your brain or something, right? There. But it's also fragile. I feel like you did a lot though. You did it so much in life. You've helped your ancestors here. This is what I'm saying. You've um, you've freed your, your ancestors. You've healed a lot along this journey. You went through a lot and you've healed a lot. You changed. You changed. Thank you, Mother Butterfly. Metamorphosis. You went through many changes here. And the many changes, wow. G3, it's like you came here for you, but I feel like you really came here for your ancestors. I'm here with a dummy mission, but not like a dummy, like you dumb. Like a dummy, like a, a dog. Hold on, <laughs> I'm here with a dummy mission. I'm seeing a see a surgeon. I'm seeing a surgical table. And I'm seeing your ancestors. All of them. Oh, okay. So in the Bible, when before Jesus, you know, come through in Revelations, they said that they were they were they were weeping, the people were weeping to the elders or something. Like, oh, they were crying. They were, Who's going to save us? Who's going to do it? Who's going to do it? And these are people that was... They wasn't talking about the people that was alive. That's that's a crazy thing. They were talking about people that was already that was on the other side of weeping. Ah, ah, ah. Get us out of here. What is this? We're trapped. Who's going to set us free? The ants has us all trapped and locked up in, 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 in constructs and boxes and stuff. And they're like, yo, what is this? Who is going get to us, get us out of here? So I'm seeing that type of setting. But no weeping. I'm seeing no weeping and no sitting in front of no elders. And nothing like that. I'm seeing... I'm seeing elders. Oh, okay. I'm seeing four elders. I'm seeing four elders. But I'm seeing a table, an operation table. And it is like every ancestor or every 
elder element. All the four elements. Hold on. Oh, 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 oh. So it's like they put all their power or all they, they, it's like the answers came through. They put everything into this dummy, into this doll. Right? They put it into a doll. They put everything that they need to get up out of whatever they in. Because they're on the other side in something. And it's like, what is this? Okay? Uh-uh. 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 It's like, that's why it's the light and the dark. Because the, oh my goodness. So it's like light angels and dark angels on the other side together somewhere. Locked up or something. It's like, it's like, they're locked into something. And they're like, what is this? Who's going to get us out of here? So say if like, okay, hypothetically, okay, say we leave this, we leave this earth and now the brain or, or, or the soul is supposed to go to, to Venus. The souls are supposed to go to Venus, right? But now something that happened when now the souls are going to Saturn. It's like, wait. <laughs> so now it's all these souls stuck in that. Oh, the box. Yeah, rules and regulations. Yeah. Oh my goodness, y'all better be head. Y'all, y'all, they, got, they better get head. <laughs> okay, so, so that's how I go. <laughs> So they all on Saturn. So all these souls on Saturn like, yo, I'm in a box. We got to get out of here. I want to be on Venus. Why am I here? And why am I here with this? It's like, you know, now the, the, the angels up there fighting, just like the angels down here fighting, right? You got the good angels and the bad angels down here fighting because the good angels are, and, and over there, they going at it because they too damn close to each other. We too close. We not supposed to be this close to each other, baby. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to be mingling with you like this now. It's like, they in, the, they in this box like, wait, you you stink. My goodness, my robe is getting all messed up. What is this? Who's going to get us out of here? <laughs> Who's going to do it? They said, aha. Aha. That's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to get the elders. So we're going to team up with the elders. Okay? And we're going to get... Our energy, we're gonna put all our knowledge, all our wisdom, all our and everything that we have experienced when we was there. Not you, because you wasn't doing shit. Woo! I ain't talking to you. Get to the back of the line, okay? <laughs> One of the answers sitting there, like, okay, that's the drum. Get your behind over there. We don't need none of that energy in a in dummy. <laughs> Next thing you know, they down there. We got we, we need them to do something, and they drinking all day. Come on, it's like no. Oh, but they can fight. Move. It's like now we gonna get all the smart. Every all the smart ones come to the front, please. Not the drunks. Not the not the um the the, the crackheads. Cause during the eighties and nineties, y'all was bugging. I mean, what was it? The seventies, the the six, the seventies, the eighties. However it goes, the, the crack epidemic. Y'all, I don't know about y'all. It was, a, it, was a, it was a few good ones. The good ones. Please, can y'all come to the front? Country? And you know what? Actually, so, because them crackheads, y'all, they be working. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get some of them crackheads because we need some of that crackhead energy. We need them to move like a crackhead. <laughs> we need them to work like a crackhead. Yeah, yeah, Let's get that. Um, What else we need? Just, just come on. We're going to put all this energy in the dummy. And this little doll here, something. <laughs> We're gonna have all the elements. Yeah, we got the elders, the elements. Okay, we got the water, we got the fire, we got the earth, we got all of that. Then we got all that. We're gonna put all, all. They did you, they did you nice. I feel like they did you nice, G3. <laughs> they made it nice. Okay? Now, it was a bunch of people that did this. I'm saying it was a bunch of. Because this was like. So it was like, okay, this was what they decided to do. 
I'm telling you, this is what they decided to do. <laughs> they decided to. <laughs> they were like, we're going to take all the good. We're going to put in this dummy. I'm hearing somebody don't like their hair. But they gave you that hair for a reason. They don't like your nose. They gave you that nose for a reason. They don't like your mouth. You don't like this. You don't like that. They gave you all of that for a reason. Mm. They made you perfect. You are perfect. I'm telling you. They made you perfect. So you can perfectly free them. Because they want to be on Venus. How to sad. They're too, they too close. You know what I'm saying? Dark energies. They all, they feel some type of way. They think that they, they think that they in the same category as the light. Because they all in the same box. So it's like, baby, don't ever think that me and you on the same page because we in the same box. Don't do that. Don't ever think me and you same ranking because we in the same box. I still I tear your I tear your behind up in here. Yeah, they 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 they, they fed up. You know what I'm saying? They want to get out that box. They fed up. <laughs> so they sent you here to do something. <laughs> they sent you here to do something, G3. They made sure everything was perfect. Okay? Yep, yep. All that drinking and all that other stuff. Yeah, that was a part. That was because they had to give... They needed to use so-and-so, uh, the drunk. They needed to use some of him because he good fighter. He was a good fighter. She was a good fighter when, when it was here. So they, you needed that energy. So it was like, so now you got to balance out the drunken. And it's like, so so this is why life was kind of crazy because you was dealing with... You was battling a lot. Okay? <laughs> you needed some some it was some it was some prostitutes in there. I'm picking up one in the family. I'm picking up it was it was a few things that you had to experience or go through or just heal from or I don't know. You it was something that you had to go through. Okay? And it wasn't even your things. But you had to go through those things because you needed the good of the ancestor too. It's like you you had to get you got you got to, you had to get the good with the bad. Okay? And when you mastered the bad or when you healed or 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 balanced out that bad aspect of the ancestor, it was like you you you're freeing them from Saturn. So that's so that's what the whole point. The whole point is so that you can free them. Because Saturn is something about recycling it's a recycle so they was trying to they trying to get it so that when they recycle back in when they something will be all in alignment so that when they when they dip off again they'll go to venus instead of to saturn you're here you're changing the tr you're changing where your ancestors go this is this is why they activated all of your ancestors because it was everybody that was in the box. It was you had the light ancestors and the dark ancestors in the same box that wanted to get out of the box. The dark ancestors don't want to be in there either. Okay? They want to be on Mars somewhere. They want to be on Mars. <laughs> they, they don't want to be over there trapped in Saturn. They want to be on Mars. So they're like, yo, I'm going to get out of this box too. So like, if I got to work with y'all, with your uppity behind, I guess I'm gonna have to work with your uppity behind until we get out of here. And it's like, <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. I like uppity. Because if you would have said anything else, you would have had my foot up your, uppity your age. <laughs> it's like, they, they up there, they, I'm telling you, they, they, they ready to get out of that box. So that's why you are very significant here. You are very significant at this time in life. Okay? What a beautiful time. What a, what a beautiful time to be alive because things are changing. Saturn is losing its power. So that the other so so other people can be powerful, other, other energies can be powerful too. It's like, dang, why do you think that you get to have all the power? And all the control. <laughs> 
Saturn, Santa, Father Time. Yeah, Dad. And it's not even Dad. Sister, it's not even Dad. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I sounded like what? <laughs> Stop playing Dad. <laughs> like, what was It's not even, it's not even dead. <laughs> it's toxic masculinity. That's what it is. I really want power here. That's what I'm saying. Mars and Venus and, and and Pluto and Uranus is like I'm not calling this nigga dad. <laughs> Saturn, uh, all of them. Look at that Saturn. Like I'm not call. I'm, I don't want to call this nigga. Neptune's is like I did. <laughs> like why we? Mercury is like I'm my own. You know I'm. I'm why? I'm tired of looking at Saturn like he's dead when we all know that Saturn is just like us. Son. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> That's what's happening here. So the energies are mad. The energies are just like, okay, the, the, planets are, the planets are like, okay, what's happening here? Uranus. It's like, you know, where's, where's my souls at? Where's the souls? I need, I need, we need people to, to, to get the land right. You know what I'm saying? It's like, things are not right because some, because Saturn got everybody wrapped up and trapped in there, in the box. Oh, the black box and Jews, but let me not even say that because the next thing you know, psh, I'm on the back room bill card and it's like, I didn't even do anything. I'm just reading the energy. It's like, like, please. I love us all. You want a box suit? I'm trying to get you out the box suit. <laughs> you know? But yeah, something about that. But you, you know they say them Jews ain't the Jews. Cause then they say like the Jews are the Gentiles. Said so Jesus came for the Jews. So Jesus came for the Jews. And everybody else is a Gentile. Who said that? Don't call what I call clean unclean, right? So who is not a Jew? Who gave Jews and who who said that? Who said this? What was sent? What was seated? What, what what was seated at the heart of that man? That that or that or, or that woman? Whoever it was, I don't care who it was. What gender? Who said that? I called everything good. And you turn around and start calling everything bad. Why you do that? Control. Mm, 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 mm. This is why they intimidated G3 because they're losing their control. So hold on, hold on. And this is why these people are being hunted by things that are that they can't even imagine. They have just the answers that they have just started to play. See. The light and the dark teamed up. The moths, the moths and everything, when you go outside, it's a bunch of things attracted to the light. 
So what the ancestors did was set up a light to draw these hunters in. Ah, <laughs> the dummy. Something is going on with the dummy here. <laughs> it's like, I don't know. They could have been a group of people trying to use a voodoo doll against you. But your ancestors already did it first. <laughs> G3, you was a doll before you was even here. Wait, hold on. Wait. You was a doll before you were even here. real deep south in the woods type magic I'm picking up on right now okay they could have been alive hold on this could have happened I'm, I'm thinking I, I, because I Hold on, <laughs> because I'm picking up on it. Is that, you know, they're giving me different scenes and stuff like that. So I'm thinking about this being, this happening on the other side. This happened here. <laughs> Where they was all in a room. You had the good with the bad all in a room or something. And they was like, we can't take this. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, I don't, and even the good ones was, they were bad. They, they, they turned bad because it was like, I guess, Wh wherever they were at or whatever they whatever system they were in it was just too much so what they did and i'm picking up i'm not seeing a, a a skin color here you know i'm picking up on i'm just seeing bodies you know i'm not seeing like colors of people i'm just seeing bodies like i just see them there but i can't see what color they are but it's like so I feel like that I feel like that matters though. Cause it was more than one. It was a group. It was more, it was all over. I don't know if it was. Black is white and white is black. I, what? <laughs> all right. And they made a doll. They made a doll and they put all of a piece of them on the doll or something. Then I say like a dumb, it's like a doll. They, they put something all on this doll. Somebody prayed for me. They had me on their mind. They took the time to pray for me. They prayed. They prayed for a, like a, a savior, uh, like they they did, they prayed for it, but they put it in a doll. Yo, I don't know. <laughs> it's like as above, so below. They did this here so it can be there and then come here. <laughs> they made like a super human and they sent it off. <laughs> and they was waiting for the return. And that's why your ancestors are going, they will tear this is why these people, it's no mercy. It's no mercy for anybody that was coming for you. You know what they had to do? You know what the ancestors had to do to get you here? So you can go on the mission so that when they return through the cycle, they can get, they don't have to be recycled back to Saturn. They can go to Venus or something like that.
it's animals that act like humans. That's what they tell me. It's animals that act like humans because they've been recycled so many times. These animals do not come out. They're telling me the legend of Bigfoot. What the heck is going on here now? <laughs> it's like, <laughs> like these myths and these legends are these beings that have been recycled so many times that they're, they're trapped. It's lions that 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 like it's animals that you don't see that will will not make themselves seen because they're they are like human animals or something. And this is what they've been trying to do. Oh. Oh, that's what they've been trying to do. <laughs> they've been trying to recycle the soul so much through Saturn that it that they can program the animals and the the, the you know, it's like It's like, cause it's something about Bigfoot. Oh, hold on. What is this movie that they showed me about wolves? It was a wolf. During the Viking times. When was the Vikings Viking it? <laughs> when was the Vikings Vikings Viking it? Because something about during the Vikings, <laughs> something about the Vikings. They knew this. See, they be talking about myths and stuff like that, but these are souls that are stuck here. And. Imagine a, a well-advanced soul in like a, a bear. Okay, Bigfoot. And then it has babies. Something like, I don't know what's happening here. But I feel like this is why your protection is so strong. Your protection is so strong because of... The fact that you are here to free people or free souls, free your ancestors from whatever bo this, this box that they're in. And it's people down here that are working for the box. That's why they're intimidated. They work for the box. Okay. Okay. It's people think, oh, the box to deal with the Jews and stuff like that. No, 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 no. It's, it's people that work for the box. That's more than, than any time. That's every any race, any any color, any any age. There's people that work for the box. And like Morpheus told Neo, these are the most dangerous people that work for the box. Because anybody that's trying to free people out of the box, they wanna they wanna sacrifice. Cause no, we work for the box. We need the box to keep. We need the box to run. We need these rules and these regulations. Mm. So these people that work for the box try to sacrifice you. But the thing about it was, now these people are, now they're running all around the box. Now they're running all around the box. Wishing they had a way out the box. You will die in this box. This is what I'm hearing. Just like you tried to kill, just like you tried to off our greatest creation. G3. Something about you being their greatest creation. You are, you are the great. Your ancestors took time. Yeah. They took time. You are buried somewhere. I don't know. You, you are a dog somewhere. I don't know. <laughs> and these people tried to do it. These people tried to do a, a dog spell or, or do a, 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 
put a hoodoo doll, a voodoo doll. They try to connect a hoodoo doll, a voodoo doll to a doll that has all power. It's like an all powerful doll. They try to connect something to a to. And 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 they're begging your ancestors. They're begging. I'm sorry. C can we fix it? No, no, no. I'm gonna focus on me now. I'm gonna do what I'm here to do. I'm not gonna chase them down and hunt them down. I'm gonna, no, 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 no. Forgive me. I'm sorry. Please, please. No. Run. We like our food moving. Your superpower is your sight. That's your superpower here, G3. That's your superpower here. And it's because it's more than you seeing through those eyes. <laughs> oh, they did something with the doll here. Uh, hold on, they did something with the doll here so that over there, They'll have, it'll be over there. So then when they get over there, they can send it back over here. I don't know what they, what they did, but it was something going on where they did, they did some type of process here. So now you're a dog, G3. Like you are a dog, you are our ancestral dog. <laughs> and they use, so you see how in Beauty and the Beast, they had the magic mirror. Let me see what's happening, so and so. Show me, so and so. It's like they have something. It's like your eyes are a, are are their mirror or something. It's like they can they see through your eyes. And this is why. Oh, so because I'm like, what am I seeing? So you. So they see through your eyes and you see through their eyes. That's what I'm saying. It's something about your eyes. It's a superpower here. I'm, I'm, I'm screaming, right? I'm sorry I'm screaming. <laughs> I just felt like I was screaming just so loud just now. Was I talking like that the whole time? My bad. Ground your energy. Yeah, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy here. Oh, goddess. Uh, I didn't even tell you what else is here. What time is it? Nine, nine, nine. Goddess of the unknown. A new chapter of your life is around the corner. Remove fear and embrace the unknown. And I feel like that's what... See, you're here to experience something, a new chapter here. Because every chapter, every, every level that you reach or every level that you connect to, it's like it's another ancestor or it's something, it's, it's ancestors that you are releasing. It's people that you are connecting to. It's souls that you are freeing from a box. So every level you're freeing, you're, you're, you're being freed and you're freeing, it, you're freeing your ancestors, okay? They need you. I need you now, oh, I need you now. Oh. The thing about it is, we be singing that to them. We singing that to them, and they singing that to you. You sing, you, it's like your ancestors need you or something here. And this is why they're going to protect this new chapter at all costs. This is why you get to have the last laugh. Goddess of psychic protection. What you believe, you create. No one can harm you. Nobody is going to harm you in this new level. And nobody is going to be a hindrance. Because everybody that was that was trying to sacrifice you. Sacrifice you because you're tapping to your tree of life. Every, they're all being hunted by things they cannot see. Taurus energy here. Hidden cameras, tapped phones. This is this this came out before. The other day when I was doing Hennessy, the Hennessy. It's like somebody's using doing something with technology 
or somebody was trying to do something with technology to to see what you were creating somebody was trying to and, and i know because somebody was trying to tap into my phone my phone was doing some type of weird stuff you know i don't know what's going on i know they were trying to tap into my phone or somebody was trying to do something to my phone oh man this is one man that's harassing me so much and i swear to goodness when i when 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 something is tangible i will be going to the courts I will be going to the cops because you're bugged. <laughs> and he knows who I'm talking about. All right. So. And he's watch, watching and probably typing in because he, he comes he comes into my lives from different accounts and be typing. And be typing. And then he have white people as the, 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 the uh, what is that called? The icon. But it's, and, and, and it's his black behind. Oh, it's his indigenous aboriginal behind. <laughs> Stop hiding behind white icons. You don't even like white people. Stop it. <laughs> Weirdo. Thought I didn't catch him. Thought I didn't catch him. I caught you, bro. You sick. <laughs> you weird. <laughs> And you took you too old to be acting like this. You too old to not have no control of yourself. <laughs> Influencers, exactly. They're trying to tap into the phones of influencers. Okay? They're trying to spy on influencers here. Because these influencers. These influencers that are, and not, that's not me. No. <laughs> no, 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 I know. Listen, if you, if you got a white icon and, and you white, I'm not talking about you. You know, shout out, shout out to, to my white crew. You know, to my white brothers and sisters. <laughs> Love you, okay? And my Asians, my Asian brothers and sisters, my Mexicans bro brothers and sisters. You know, we, we live over here. It's all of us. But, um, these influencers, they trying to see what these influencers are doing because these influencers are a threat to the box. Th these influencers are a threat to the box. Shout out to the clears. <laughs> All got red blood, red blood. Well, some got well blue blood, some got gold blood. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta have an eye to see that. White witch. So it's a hidden. It's a, so somebody got a hidden camera, or or it's a white witch who's an influencer. And white is black, and black is white. So let's not. But you know what I'm saying? White means light. It's a light witch. You have your dark witches, your dark warlocks, and your and your light witches, and your light and your your white witches and your white ones. Let's. I, I hate that. I hate that we so we so caught up in color, right? I hate that. But not that I hate them because I, I feel like it's beautiful too. I love differences. Like why? Like it's beautiful. That's a beautiful thing. That it's different things going on. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's like wow. It's like you don't look at the rainbow and be like, oh, we don't. I don't like that color. Why is that color in there? <laughs> it's like we look at the rainbow and be like, oh. So beautiful. It's beautiful, but um, but uh, it's a hindrance sometimes to elevation. That's the only thing I don't like about it. But um, hidden cameras and tap phones, and and mind you, everybody's on their journey, so y'all can, hey, wherever you are, you can be. You racist, you racist. Just don't bring that ass over here. You know what I'm saying? I'm not. I'm not about to get get with you. Before. I used to, cause I, you know, I grew up in a black household with, with black, you know, I went to a black school and I was around a bunch of black people. If we had white people in our schools, they was black. <laughs> it's like, so, you know, it was, it was, oh, that's how you, you grew up with that, with that racist kind of mentality and stuff like that. But then you grow out of it. So, but some people don't. And that's all now. Just don't bring it over here. Okay. <laughs> 
that's not what we're about. Um, and my movement is not the only movement that's popping. You know, get your movement going and have your racist ideas over there. You know what I'm saying? And do that. You know what I'm saying? That's all. I won't be over there. But you are welcome over here. Okay? Um, yeah, so it's some type of good person. Okay? It's some type of good energy. Okay? It's some type of good... And don't, don't, no fighting in the, in the, in, that's, it's no fighting. I'm the main show here. Not the comments. Hidden cameras and tap phones. White witch and influencer. So they're trying to tap into the phone. And this is why your answers are mad, going hand on people. Because they're trying to tap into your, most, your, your private times and, and things that are private. They're trying to tap into private things, things that don't concern them, things that that don't matter to them. What? What does it matter? What you texting your mother? This, it have nothing to do with them. It's like people are trying to get into personal information. I got a whole, I got a whole uh, 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 letter. Hold on, where's this letter? And that's how I know this man is, is crazy. I sent this man my, my address to send me a book because that's what he said that he was he needed my address for when I first woke up. But now I got people sending me old oh, student loan information and how do you get to, to tap into your account? Oh, Caroline, they got my whole address and stuff up here. It's like people think that they slick, they funny, they they try, they they trying a lot, they're doing a lot, and this is why I want you run. Run. Keep dancing. Everybody that was messing with me, dancing now. Ah, 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 ah. Dance. Dance. And don't stop till we say stop. <laughs> These are undercover lovers. These are people that can't even be who they are. These are people that are still hiding their sexuality. If you like guys, you like guys. If you like girls, you like girls. Whatever it is, why are you hiding it? Trying to act like something that you not. These people are trying to find hidden things. So they're trying to hide and, and get into your energy to, to try to find something that's going on with you because they got so many things going on with them. You, why are you so perfect? I, this is why they people are people are trying to attack you because they think that you're so perfect. So they're trying to find something. Well, they're trying to find where something is wrong with you. Something gotta be wrong with you. No, something is wrong with you. That's what something something is wrong with you. You can't even be who you are. You're hiding yourself. That's when that's what's wrong. People be really projecting their energy. Projecting onto you. First of all, you don't you you ain't walking around thinking that you perfect. A white witch ain't perfect. You know what they've been through? You know what they had to go through to become a white witch? It's easy to be a dark witch. It's easy to do that dark shit. It's easy. This is work. So no, the white witch ain't perfect. They're perfected. Ha! No, no, no. Oh my goodness. The white witch is not perfect. They're perfected. They got, they, they got it together. They, they're not walking around, oh, I'm perfect. I'm this. No, we went through some things and we perfected our lives along the way. So somebody's like, oh, something got to be wrong with you. No, that's your energy that you're projecting. Something is wrong with you. First of all, get out that closet. And you can see. You all up in the dark, in the closet, trying to hide, looking for something. How are you trying to look for something and you hide? Somebody want to know something about you, they got to come and ask you. But see, this is somebody that can't come and ask you anything. So they got to they gotta hide. They got to do all of this hidden stuff because they can't come and ask you nothing. They can't never talk to you again. They'll never have another conversation with you again. 
They'll never be in your energy again. They'll never see you face to face ever. They'll never be able to look you in your eyes. Unless they do this type of S right here. Unless they do all of this. They hide. Hide behind fake pages. Hide behind email, uh, 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 fake, fake, fake letters and stuff. And, uh, just hide it. That's all they can do. But now you want forgiveness? No, we want you to dance. We like our food moving. Dance, 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 dance all night. It was one interview. They said that Michael Jackson, well, whatever he was tapping into, whatever he was doing, whatever rituals or something he was doing, sometimes whatever he was tapping into, it didn't fall to the dance. He could not stop dancing. He was dancing for hours. He was just being there, get the piano player to tell him to come in there and play, and he was just being there dancing because he can't stop dancing because something he done tapped into don't, don't, don't want him to stop dancing. <laughs> Make that nigga dance all night. Okay? And shout out to Michael Jackson. Be careful what you're tapping into. That's all. You know, you were talented before you tapped into that. You can dance before you tapped into, this, tapped into whatever you tapped into. Now look at you. Well, not look at you now, but you know, before. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> before, look. Now, can't, can't go to sleep because you dance all, all night. Be careful what you're tapping into. <laughs> For real. So, yeah. Your ancestors got these people dancing. Got these people making fools of themselves. <laughs> Big up to Michael Jackson. No, I like me some Michael Jackson. Billy Jean is not my lover. Ooh, just a girl that think that I am the one. You know, I like me. I like me some Michael Jackson. But his behind was in there dancing until he couldn't, because he couldn't sleep. He was forced to dance. Because, yeah, when you... It's, it's energy exchange. We need your energy. Dance. Ah, that's what it is. So your ancestors are draining them of their energy before they sink their teeth into their skin. <laughs> that's not funny, but you know what I'm saying. You should have been doing this. This is not funny. This is not funny. Mind your business. Stop trying to sacrifice people. Stop trying to harass people. Stop trying to get in people's energy when you need to be getting out the closet. These people be, they don't even, you know what? Because G3, my mouth is crazy. It can get crazy in here, but I be trying to keep it cute. <laughs> As I seen before, it used to get crazy, but I be trying to keep it real cute now. And not too cute, but you know, more PG. So, you know, me and Instagram can still be in a good relationship. Then magic on your children. See, this is, this is when it gets crazy. Because once you start doing magic on my children, now death, disaster, and destruction is all that I want for you. Yeah? Once you, take, once you bring my daughter into any type of magic, I want death, disaster, and destruction for you. And I don't want anything else. And that's all I'm asking my ancestors for. And I don't got to do nothing. But use these two, these two lips. These two mouths. Ooh. Use these two lips. That's all I got to do. You doing magic on children, death, disaster, and destruction. Dance. Ain't no, we, it's no mercy for these people. The wrath of God. My, my, my. My, my, my. It's no word. It's no mercy for these people. <laughs> Once you do magic on the children, now the wrath of God is on your life. And it will not come off until you hit the dirt. The wrath of God will be all over your life until you hit that dirt. Yeah. Once you bring my daughter, once you bring G3 children, yeah, my G3 family, you got children. Once they bring your children into some type of magic because they threatened by you, because they, oh, they couldn't sacrifice you. So they said, let's try the child. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, now you got the wrath of God on it. And I don't know because I got Shekmet down there. I don't know if you want. Shekmet is the wrath of God.
These people are going down. I'm hearing Beset, because ooh, Cat is here. Yeah, so Beset and Shekmet. Shekmet is protecting Beset. It's something about you, Beset. Beset, because that's what divine beauty, right? She's, she's giving off beauty. She's giving off smelling good, very loving and sensual. That's the energy that she give off, right? Beset. It's something about, it's like, It's like Zeus attacking Ursula or something to get back Ariel. That's what I feel like. I feel like something, that's the energy. Like some type of fight. Let's kiss and make up. Somebody want to somebody wanna make up now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Can we talk about it? Can we talk about it? I want to talk about it. Let's not talk about who's right or who's wrong. Yeah, you brotherhood, huh? You protected from this brotherhood. Or you're being protected by a brotherhood. I don't know. But there is, you being protect, there is some type of protection here. Okay? Uh, from a Virgo. Mm -hmm. A Virgo who, who a, a narcissistic Vir Virgo who did not care about a man's worth or a woman's worth or something like that okay something about october is significant sigils you are protected by sigils that's what it is too is sigils around a dog i feel like some your ancestors are upset because they did they already did a dog for you or something like that and this people are oil is somebody that's Playing with some type of hoodoo doll, a voodoo doll, a booger tea, or a referee, or whatever they want to call it. They're trying to play with that. And they got some type of sigils around it or something. Somebody about to lose their whole house. Somebody was doing magic on you in their house. Make it make sense. That's what I heard. Somebody did magic on you in their house. The ancestors was deep in the woods when they did something to you. I guess because they, they see people, when you don't know what you're doing, you shouldn't be doing it. You got divine protection from this type of brotherhood. It's, 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 these are hunters going at the white witches. It's brotherhoods out here that's really going at the white witches. Okay? They're really trying to tap, tap into these white witches, to these, these truth tellers and these truth speakers. They're trying their hardest to destroy these white witches because they are a threat to whatever type of gay ass they got going on. It's a lot of gay stuff going on in these brotherhoods. And they love to dance, right? You, they love to dance. They love it. Dance. Now, they, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. they love to dance. <laughs> dance. Dance then. Dance now. Let's see how you... Mm -hmm. There's certain things that I've been hearing that I just don't want to say. I'm telling you, I, because my mouth... Very powerful. I don't be wanting to say certain things. <laughs> Cause it's like I don't I don't really I don't wish that on anybody, but I know that my mouth and it's not even me wishing it on. It's happening. Me not saying it is not gonna stop it from happening. I just want somebody to know that. Cause I my mouth is not making anything happen. My mouth is confirming what is happening. So I my mouth I'm not making anything happen with my mouth it's just certain things that I don't want to say because it's like that's crazy and I don't, I don't want to see that and it's like I don't because I'm picking up on paraplegic somebody gonna have the wrath of God on them their whole life I'm hearing don't mock God <laughs> These people in brotherhoods be mocking God or something like that. Be mocking the most high or something like that. But they be coming after. See, I feel like they mocking God by coming after these white witches or something like that. I don't know. But all I know is that there is there's protection on your over your children. They try, they try to do. So I feel like something you're getting the last laugh because something is somebody's about to be a paraplegic. Gang members, and they and it's because it's somebody gonna get their a whooped. Somebody, somebody about to get their a whooped.
Mm-hmm. Somebody about to get the A whooped. By some gang members. And then I say the brain is something so fragile, all it takes is one little soap. All it takes is one, one little swap. But this is somebody that was doing magic on your children. Somebody that had hidden cameras in your house trying to tap into your phones, trying to ruin something for you. Because somebody can't stand that you are an influencer. Somebody can't stand that you are the truth. Somebody can't stand that they can't get in. These people are hating from outside of the club. It's something about the chosen club. Somebody want to be a part of the chosen club. First of all, you got to get out the closet. You can't be part of the chosen club in the closet, baby. Okay, we're not saying that you can't like the, like the same sex. We're not saying that, but we're saying that if you're going to do that, you have to do the outside of the closet, baby. Okay? <laughs> okay? So if you want to be part of the chosen, first of all, you got to get out the closet. You got to stop hiding the fact that you like men, that you like things in your butt. You got to stop. You got to stop that. And it's okay. Okay? It's okay. I, I mean, I guess. That's what you like. That's, that's between you and your bowels. I ain't got nothing to do with that. But you 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 want to be chosen? Get up out the closet. That's that's. I'm not gonna say that's gonna. Now you're chosen because you up out the closet. But you have a better chance at, at at being at being a part of the at getting into the club, being your authentic self, and not hiding in some type of under the covers. I'm sick of them people. I'm sick. I'm sick. Sick of that. Be yourself. Because these undercover lovers be the ones that be one that that in the in the forefront. They wanna they wanna be with the opposite sex. They wanna love up on the opposite sex. Make it seem like they all about the opposite sex. Make it seem like they you know real a real man or a real woman or real masculine or real feminine. They be trying to make it seem like something. But the truth of the matter is they getting bent over. The truth of the matter is they wanna bend somebody over. And not a female. The truth of the matter is, you know how many pastors? This is giving me church. You know how many pastors? They got first ladies. And, and they cannot do the missionary. They cannot have sex with their wives missionary. Do you know that? Because they don't like women. But they like that. <laughs> and that's not funny. Sis, leave that man. You know he don't want you. You know he don't want you. These people be getting on my nerves. And these are the people that be sitting there and, and then the wife be right with the husband doing magic on you. What's wrong with your stoop? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like, you sitting there doing magic on me and, all, and your man can't even look you in the eye when y'all intimate all he want to do is see the back of your neck and your 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 spread wide that's all he want to see from you and you doing magic on me are you crazy if you don't leave that situation go be happy you already have to like, they be trying to really because because now the because now you're a paraplegic and you in the closet and not so so not a couple the the husband or the, somebody a paraplegic somebody don't like to say it's like this is, why why ruin your lives like this somebody ruined their life trying to ruin yours all because you were an influencer and you influence people <laughs> let me go three 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 on the clock let me get one more thank you an obsessed ex this is who we talking about here G three somebody that you put extra boundaries towards. You get the last laugh when it comes to this obsessed ex. You want to know why? Because your ancestors took their time with you. You know the the means where it says God. Um, this is this is the this is what God used when they, when they made me and they put the water here. They water. Yeah, that's significant. Yeah, that's what they when making you. They were very strategic in making you. So they're gonna make sure everybody that comes up in your energy dance for free. <laughs> So they're not even going to be getting paid for these dance moves. They're going to be getting their Chris Brown on and not even getting paid for it. Damn. Okay. And you better not stop. You be, if, you, if you stop dancing, we eat you. <laughs> the longer you dance, the longer you stay alive. Okay. Oh, man. 
This is what I'm hearing. This is what Michael Jackson was. <laughs> Listen, let's learn from the ancestors, okay? <laughs> anyway, anyway, I love y'all so much. If y'all got anything from this message and you, and you want to leave your a donation, all of my information is down below. Thank you guys so, so much for tuning in. Let me run for this bus. And yeah, until next time, make sure you guys um, subscribe to the YouTube channel. I got some YouTube videos uploading, okay? So yeah, we, want, we, we getting busy. We getting busy. <laughs> I love you guys. Thank you, sis. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Until next time. Bye. Oh, and Stella, you still here? Everybody check check out Stella, ask Stella, because I see you, sis. You doing your thing. Keep it going. That's a, And I know it's tiring. I know it's tiring sometimes. And that's with anybody and everybody. If you're building something and you, you're really creating something, you go, you have to work. You got to work stupid. Okay? You got to go crazy. <laughs> so, shout out to Stella. I see you, sis. Um, and yeah, and to everybody else who is really um, grinding and building something, keep going. Okay? I love you guys. And until next time.